I won't say there's a place on earth that would ever present freedom for me because you would get to that place, you would experience it and in the next moment you would think by yourself that would be a great hiding place or yeah this can happen, no one will see. There's a lot of things that would come up then. The moment that you say you've got fear inside of you then anything can happen. You open all doors so anything that you're afraid of or it, it, it starts as an idea in your mind and then it, it starts growing and then you start speaking it and then it happens. People are so vulnerable. I mean, even if they, uh, if there is a farm attack or a housebreak or whatever, I mean, you can't run out his front door and shout to the neighbor, come and help me, because there is no one there. The neighbor's not going to hear him because he's half a kilometer away or a kilometer away, whatever the fact may be. You've got your fence, you've got your alarm system. Now they can't get to you at the house, now they wait for you in the road. If they want to get to you, then they will get to you. We had just finished eating. Uh, the twins were ready in the bed. I put each one of them into their own rooms. When I walked to the front door and I barely touched the door to open it, then a person, a black male, he opened the door further and he was standing in front of me. He had a gun in his hand. Uh, he was pointing that towards my face. And at that time, I think everything just froze. You feel very powerless when they enter. You know that uh, it, it was your turn now to be attacked. Well, I don't feel safe at the moment. I don't feel uh, I don't feel safe at all. My trust in my safety is gone. So at the moment, that is, it may change, you know. But at the moment, I don't feel I can go and sleep now there and think that maybe they will come in again, because it can happen. Then one has to find a way to live with it. You know, you, you, it, it won't go away by itself. You can't run away from it. So in some way or other, you live with it. I had one way of working with anxiety, and that was by telling myself a fairy tale backwards to overcome fear. Available now on Video On Demand.